Hey Jules, this is Shante. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel today. In today's video, I am just going to be doing a small Hobby Lobby haul um, that I picked up in the last week or so. And I came across, I said I was never going to buy, not never, but I didn't need to buy any more Happy Planner books because I have a ton. But this one just caught my eye, so I had to pick it up. So if you're interested in seeing what I got from Hobby Lobby, please stay tuned. Okay, you guys, as you can see, it is a very small haul. I have about three items here. Um, the first item I'm going to go through washi tape. I also said that I probably wasn't going to buy any more washi tape. You guys, but these are just so cute to me. Um, anybody who knows me in person knows that I love leopard prints in any form that it comes in. And when I saw this, this just reminded me of leopard print. It was so, it is so, so, so cute that I even paid full price for it. I didn't even wait to the 50% off sale um, because I didn't want it to be sold out. I don't know if it is new, but it is new to me. It is by the Paper Studio, and of course that is from Hobby Lobby. Um, it originally retailed for $5.99, but if you wait for their sale, you can get it for half price. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. Um, and I am a fan as I've come through my planner journey, I noticed that I'm a fan of the more, not the skinny, skinny washies. I tried those for a bit too and I really didn't like them. Um, but this is about a perfect size, maybe a little bit more, but about a perfect size to me. I'm not a fan of the really thick washies, but I'm gonna try to get this up closer in the camera. You guys, these are super, super cute. So if you see this first one here is like, I believe it's like a tan print or so. Um, and then the second one is like a pinkish mauve color. This is more of a traditional like leopard print color to me, this one. And then you have the blue and then you have this other like um, in the purple family um, mixed with a little bit of gold. So just look at these, you guys. These are beautiful. So I absolutely love those and I had to pick it up. Like I said, I even picked it up for full price. Um, I wanted to do the book last. So you guys, I was so excited to find this. This is not new, but it could be new to some of you. Um, I really had my eye on the like leopard print theme when it first came out through Happy Planner. I'm not sure how long it's been out, um, but I really don't need additional things. So I just usually don't buy a lot like I used to. Um, so this was originally $12.99. And it's called like a planner's accessory pack, but it is for the big, which I use the big a lot um, for some like business things um, and also for some other committees that I am on. So I like to stay organized. And it was on Hobby Lobby about a week or so ago for 324. So I was like, I have to snatch it up because that was a really good deal. So um, let me try to remove the sticker on the back. Sorry for all the noise. Think it's coming off but um i was going to try to read off what it says it includes but let me just take it off the packaging and we'll go through it so you guys i just again i love leopard leopard and so you get this little tab divider and it says find your wild um it's super super cute and again it goes for the happy planner big or if you have like the tool planner, you can use it for that as well. Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> I think this kind of got undone. Yeah, I think that's just the piece of plastic there. Um, and then you also have this folder here. Your heart with what's important and forget the rest. And that's absolutely true. Um, if you guys know me, I am definitely a big I'm big on motivational um, themes and quotes. Um, and then you also get these little like sticker sheets with a couple of um, stickers. It says you can and you will get it done. Always believe in your wildest dreams and you got this babe. This is super cute to me. And then you have um, a bunch of to do's, doctor's appointments, things that you can get done, things you need to remember um, and appointments. And then you guys, you get some additional sheets of paper that can go in your planner. So if you are trying to um, organize your week, so you get the Monday through Sunday on the front page and it says the week of, um, and then on the back it is 
dot grid. So I'm not sure uh, how many of each you get, but it looks like a good amount of sheets of paper to me. I would probably at least say 20. And they all have this cute front. So they all have that cute front and then the dark grid on the back. So I really, really like this. And I thought it was, I don't think it was a bad price for $12.99 um, originally, but also for to get it for $3.24, I snagged it up and I thought it was super, super cute. So look out at your Hobby Lobbies. Hopefully they're not all gone if you're interested, but I did get mine about a week ago. And the last thing in my haul, you guys, is this cute floral sticker book. It's called Beauty and Florals. Um, of course, it is from the Happy Planner. Um, I'm not sure why it's only 444 pieces. I feel like that's um, a the smallest I've ever seen a sticker book come in but let's go through this really quickly these colors just spoke to me um, purple is not my favorite color but um, I would say it's in the family of my favorite colors um, and it's also my birthstone so I really really do like purple a whole lot um, but look at these stickers look how beautiful and bold they are they may not be speaking spring right now but I'm still going to use them um, and some of the stickers say, life is your journey, surround yourself with beauty, follow your heart, um, be a light in this world. Look at all these to-do stickers. I love how they kind of really made these to-do stickers pop because sometimes to-do stickers can be very boring and bland, but I do love how they made those to-do stickers pop. And there's another set so you know a lot of times um, including myself I've heard people say that they usually do a top three of things that need to get done per day and that's how I am because sometimes you can definitely get overwhelmed with all of the things that you need to do so I usually try to pick out the top three things that I need to get done for the day and if there's anything else that I can get in addition to that that's great um, but also if there are things that I need to flow over to the next day I would do those things on the next day as well but usually I at least have a top three and I'm not really sure this um almost looks like it's for gratitude it says what is one thing you're grateful to have in your life and then how can you continue to show that gratitude um what is your favorite moment of the day and how can you create moments like this again and I think that's very important um it's always been on my mind to do like more of a gratitude kind of journal but i never really have gotten to be really nice for a gratitude journal i mean this purple is just popping so you have a couple of pages of those these are just beautiful and i love the shape of these um so it looks like some of the sayings are the same but just different in how they are laid out day don't forget how wildly capable you are yes absolutely again you guys this was just so pretty to me and i like this um so i hope you can see it but this says reflect so on my weekly scripture writing i usually do monday through friday and on saturdays i just like to reflect back through the week um and the word of god and how it impacted my life, um, what I can learn from it, how I can live by it. Um, and so I could really use these stickers that at the end of my scripture writing. So I like those. And then these are, how are you feeling? Guys, these are just so pretty. This purple is just screaming to me. I love, and then you have the flower stickers as well. I mean, for 444 stickers, I feel like this is probably one of the best books. And I'm not even finished yet. And some more quotes. You are where, you are where, <laughs> you are rare. Just be brave. You are okay. And you are kind. And there are more stickers, you guys. These are so cute. So these are the little washi strips. Oh. So cute 
here are some more quotes. One of them says, you make the world a more beautiful place. Oh, this one is just screaming my name, you guys. And again, here are all the beautiful florals. And I am definitely a floral girl. Beautiful, beautiful florals. Oh, I am like, you guys are gonna be seeing florals for the next couple of weeks, so get ready. And then here is the last page. So you guys, this book is absolutely beautiful to me. I mean, like I said, I haven't picked up a Happy Planner sticker book in a while just because I have so many, but this one spoke volumes to me. So if you are interested, it is, I got this one from Hobby Lobby. I'm not sure if it's at Michael's or Joann's. It is probably online that you can get from the Happy Planner website. Um, but I did pick this one up last week when it was 40% off um, and it is Beauty in Floral. So that is my haul for today. I hope you guys enjoyed all the items that I picked up um, let me know what are you currently using in your planners are you using more stickers are you using washi tape or are you just writing in every day what you need to write in because planning planning is truly what you make of it and what it is what is most meaningful to you um, I've said in previous videos there was a time when I was super super busy as far as working full-time grad school other obligations and I could not decorative plan. I had to write in where I needed to be and make sure that I got there. And that worked for me in that period of my life. And so now that I'm no longer in that period of my life and I have time, I always say planning is my therapy. And it truly is because it is very calming to me. Um, it's not something that I look at and, and I'm like, oh my God, I have to get all this stuff done. It is something that I, that truly the process of decorating my layout um, and then throughout the week, looking back at something that I've decorated, it is very calming to me. So I do love the idea of decorative planning, even though at heart, I'm more of a functional planner. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have not subscribed already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Help me on my journey to obtain a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. Um, and then also share my channel with a friend. If you're not following me on Instagram, my name is simply Shanta Renee Plans on Instagram. I would love for you to support me over on that platform as well. And you guys, I want you to have an awesome, blessed day. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.